Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to solve the 26th and 27th question from CBSE Class 10 Examination 2022-23, Section C, where each question is of 3 marks. Now, this question is from pair of linear equations in two variables chapter. Half of the difference between two numbers is 2. The sum of the greater number and twice the smaller number is 13. Find the numbers. Now here two situations are given. The first one is half of the difference between two numbers is 2. So let us consider that the two numbers are a and b. And let us consider that a is the greater number and b is the smaller number. Now let us focus on the first given statement. Saying that half of the difference between the two numbers is 2. So let us generate an equation from the given statement. So here half of, so half is nothing but 1 over 2 and of in mathematics represents a product. So 1 over 2 times the difference between the two numbers. So we have taken the greater number minus the smaller number is equal to. So that is going to be equal to 2. So this is going to be the representation of the first statement. Now we can simplify this, that is taking this 2 on the other side of the equal to sign. The 2 multiplies with 2, giving us a minus b is equal to 2 times 2, which is 4. Let us consider that as our equation 1. Next, let us look at the second statement. The sum of the greater number and twice the smaller number is 13. So let me write here. So the sum of means that is going to be the addition of the greater number that is a which we have considered here and twice the smaller number that is 2 times b is equal to 13. Now this forms an equation let us consider this as our equation 2. Now we have to perform the simultaneous equation using elimination method or substitution method to find out the value of a and b. Now here I'll be using the elimination method. So let me write the second equation minus the first equation. So here I have written the second equation first and now I'm going to subtract the first equation from the second one. So I'm going to change the signs of each term. A is positive so I'll turn it into negative. B is negative so it will turn positive and 4 is positive so it will turn negative. Now adding these two equations that is plus a and minus a these two cancel out each other. Plus 2b and plus b gives us plus 3b. And 13 minus 4 gives us 9. So we have 3b equal to 9, which means b is going to be equal to 9 over 3. So this is going to be 3 1 times and 3 3 times. They divide each other. So we got the value of the smaller number as 3. Now once we have got this, let us find out the value of a. Now I'm going to use the first equation because it is easier. So a minus b, which we got as 3, is equal to 4. Now taking the negative 3 on the other side of the equal to sign, we get a is equal to 4 plus 3, which is going to give 7. So the greater number is 7 and the smaller number is 3. Now let us move on to the next question. Now the 27th question is from the real numbers chapter. Prove that square root of 5 is an irrational number. Now I have already solved this question in the previous video. So you can click on this link to see the solution of this question. And if you find any difficulty in understanding this question, then please let me know. I'll make another video on this. I hope you have understood all the steps and like the video in the 26th question. And if you are liking my videos, like, share and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching.